starting the day off right with a delicious homemade banana nut muffin. Mm. I have the day off today, so I'm fully free to do some snow skating. Right now, I have a few errands that I want to run and get out of the way though. Like stopping by a thrift store and getting a few things like clothes hangers and a couple other things. And then we're going to go searching for spots. Now that the skate park's closed, that won't be happening anymore. Unfortunately, I didn't even get my ambition in time for that. Mmm. Muffins are amazing. The Holy Name Church here has a thrift store and it's amazing. I went in there for some clothes hangers and I ended up coming out with one, two big bags of stuff because it's all a quarter. One quarter because it's a real thrift store. People donated the stuff and they put it out to get rid of it. They don't put it in there to try and make a bunch of money like the Salvation Army where they take people's garbage and put $30 on it and stuff. It's crazy how the Salvation Army is still even in going and running today. There should be more thrift stores like that one there. Now that we got one of the things on my list, we got to go to one more store and then I'm going to see if I can snow skate in this weather. It's like 30, 31 and the roads are super sloppy so I'm thinking the snow might be slushy and melting so that's not a good time to ride a snow skate or a snowboard or anything in the snow because you just get soaking wet. I'm going to keep my fingers crossed that we can get in a snow skate session. If not, we'll see where the day takes us. The park looks like a pretty good place to come and snow skate. The only person I'm seeing so far is this guy cleaning off the driving area in his little snow plow thing. I'm gonna go hit up the amphitheater most likely because there's a little drop there and I can't really skate flat ground on this snow skate. It doesn't slide well enough for that. It's only when I finally leave my house and start doing stuff and like want to take a scenic shot that I remember my little tripod is broken. I have a big tripod somewhere but I can't remember where it is. As soon as I find it I'm just gonna take a sticky mount and just stick it to the top of that so I can use it. I could care less if it weighs a little bit more. I was just using this for convenience but since it broke I'll just go back to using a hardcore tripod that has like the extending legs and all that stuff. Let's go see if I can do some snow skating right back then. Alright, enough playing around on that speed bump. Let's move over into the playground area. Maybe see if I can ride down a slide. And that right there is how you get a spot ready to be snow skated. <laughs> that table's some weird slick fiber. It's like slick fiberglass, just like the uh, marble. You can't get it wet and then expect to be able to push or walk on it. We are coming up here on a small but steep slide. We're going to have to give it a try, or two or three, or possibly until I actually do it. If this little bar wasn't here, things would be a thousand times easier. Ah, ah that's why you tuck your gloves. 
into your coat. Well, got a first try like nothing. It was fun though. Maybe get a couple other angles. That's about as good as that gets. Whew, 30 degrees is pretty dang hot when you're used to it being negative something. I'm working up quite a bit of sweat just walking around in this snow. All this stuff in here is super slick for my snow skate. Hopefully when I get uh, my ambition, maybe I'll be able to do these stairs or something. That would be, that's what I'm hoping is gonna happen when it arrives, is I'll be able to do stairs and drops and tricks and whatnot. Whew. Right now I'm just gonna take a breather. Woo! Basically all this is is an expensive uh, sled shaped like a skateboard. It's made out of plasticky stuff. It's bendy. The grip tape is pretty nice though. Sleds don't ever have that stuff. Made it a good distance on that one there. Whew. Oh, that's a squirrel. I just could not resist trying to maybe do a front board on this at least to see if I can get up onto it with this junkier snow skate. clean in half whoa I never would have imagined that would happen holy crap I guess that's what you get when you order cheap garbage plastic <laughs> I wonder if I could just epoxy it back together and it would probably still work for riding down hills Ah, oh, that's a freaking bummer. Ah! Right after I was landing a couple, I wanted to get one good, but of course not. Oh, my glasses are starting to fog up now. Because I'm angry and warm. Ah! I can't believe that would just break like that. I guess I thought the flex would have been enough to just keep it flexing forever but unfortunately for me today was not my day I got my other snow skate coming soon 
hopefully by this weekend and it won't break like that I'm pretty sure maybe it will who knows ah nothing left to do now but go get a pizza after I unlock my car here these freaking turkeys always oh, just wandering around out in the streets here causing freaking traffic problems and whatnot Time to go home, eat some pizza, and relax before another day of work tomorrow. And just sit around waiting for my snow skate to come because unfortunately the mail does not work like in Futurama. You don't just order it and it comes right away. I wish it did, that would be insanely amazing, but gotta sit and wait for somebody to bring it to you. I'll see you guys next time for another video. Don't forget to smash the like button and uh, leave a comment. Subscribe for more of this face out doing stuff like skateboarding, snowboarding, and maybe leave some ideas for a video and I'll see about doing those. I'll see you guys next time. Peace!